Well, it has been almost five months since Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley headed for space in SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule. They made history as the first astronauts to launch from the U.S. in almost nine years. Now SpaceX and NASA are gearing up for another crewed mission and just shared an update on Crew-1 this afternoon. News 6's James Barbero shows us how the team is preparing. With just over two weeks to lift off, it's a story all new at 6 o'clock. The Crew-1 launch was previously scheduled for this Saturday, an astronaut launch on Halloween. But a potential issue with rocket engines is delaying the launch two weeks. Five, four, three, and we have an abort. NASA and SpaceX revealing two engines on this Falcon 9 rocket tried starting early, triggering a last-second abort earlier this month. The problem was traced to a blocked relief valve in the gas generator and the team say they found similar tendencies on the Crew-1 booster. We're in the process of swapping out two engines on the Crew-1 vehicle. We have a little bit more work to do on this uh, engine anomaly, but I think we see a pretty good path to get the flight, and we'll, uh, we'll fly when we're ready. That goes for a November 10th launch, scheduled four days before the astronauts blast off. The astronauts going to space could depend on the performance of the engines powering that launch. The mission would be the first SpaceX launch of four astronauts. Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley piloted Crew Dragon in May. Well, I'm very excited. To this time, Mike year, Hopkins, Victor, Victor Glover, Shannon Walker, and Soichi Noguchi plan to stay on the International Space Station for up to six months. I know that the science community is looking forward to having all those arms and legs on orbit to be able to help them accomplish their goals for this increment. Again. Liftoff is now targeted for Saturday night, November 14th. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news six.